welcome to another show. Today I'm going to give you some ideas on how to use these spinners in the classroom. I mean, I cannot believe how popular they are with the students. So you, let's use that as an advantage to teach different subjects. All right, let's get started. Here's a fun activity you can use in your language arts or reading class, is that you can have, uh, you can put different words around the side. It can be your vocabulary words or your spelling words. And you tell the students to lightly spin this, otherwise it'll last forever. And when that stops, what you're gonna do is you're gonna write down the words and put them in alphabetic order. I'm gonna speed this up a little bit here. Okay, so we have the words yellow, gray, and brown. And so what the students have to do is they have to put these in alphabetic order. So they are practicing, if it's your spelling words or your vocabulary words of the, uh, the day, they are writing this down and they're still excited about the spinner and they're able to use their spinner in the classroom. My handwriting is not too good right now, but um, just for demonstration purposes. And, you know, you're getting them to do everything you want them to do. Uh, reading, writing, putting them in alphabetic order, and they get to play with the spinner. I mean, how cool is that? Okay, we got another fun activity for math. And so what we're going to do is we're going to spin the spinner, and I tell them to spin it, you know, softly, otherwise the spinner will last for, uh, for a long time. All right, so when the spinner stops, what we're gonna do is we're gonna have the students write down the numbers, and they can write them in any order they want to. So I'm gonna take four, seven, and one, and they have to say it, 471, and then they spin one more time. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna practice doing three-digit addition. And they get to write the numbers again in any order they want to. So maybe they choose a four again, but now they put one in the seven. So 417, and they will add that. And sometimes they'll be regrouping, and sometimes there won't be. How cool is that? They're doing math, playing with their spinner, having a fun time. Okay, here's a neat uh, idea. And this idea is that you're going to spin the spinner and while the spinner is spinning, you have to say as many sight words as you can before the spinner stops. So um, just for this purpose only, I'm gonna spin it kind of lightly and start saying the sight words. A, uh, and, big, blue, can, come, down, find, for, funny, go, help, hers, I, in, is, it, jump, little, Look, make, me, my, not, one, play, red, and run. All right, I hope I said those right. I didn't have my glasses on at the time. But once again, you're getting the students to read. You're getting them excited because they're playing with their spinner. And, you know, this is a fun activity. Hey, thanks a lot for watching the show today. If you have any other ideas on how to use these in the classroom, leave them down in the comments down below. Check out my other videos I have on my YouTube channel, and I might even have some uh, Amazon links you can take a look at. And like always, have a fun day. All right, 